welcome to my YouTube channel. If y'all don't know, I'm Miranda. I'm a registered nurse in the emergency department. And this is a continuation of my new grand nurse series. Today's video is going to be about starting off on the right foot. Basically, most new nurses have the biggest issue with getting their foot in the door and getting their first nursing job. And then, how do they function after that? The biggest thing is when you're applying for nursing jobs is know what areas you want to work in. Even if you're not destined on one specific area, when you apply to multiple different areas, make sure you already have the hospital research, have the unit research, know exactly what you're applying for before you get into an interview and they'll ask you 20 million questions and you're just like, I don't know what to do. So the biggest thing before you even apply, just call the nurse manager be like, hi, I just graduated from nursing school, I'm interested in maybe working here, can you give me a tour of the unit? Most managers will be like, yes, please, no, we, we want nurses. Some of those managers will be very open to that. So once you get to the interview, you want to go with your resume, with references, go professionally dressed, don't go in scrubs. As much as this profession wears scrubs, do not show up to your first nursing interview in scrubs. It, it doesn't look professional, it, it looks sloppy from a manager's perspective. And on top of that, when you're going with your resume and your references, make sure you go with a list of questions you want to ask the employer and the manager about specifically for that unit, like the nurse patient ratios how lunch breaks work, how benefits work, how time off works, what type of patient population you know, they normally see on that unit, what the typical nurse does on a shift in that unit, because as much as they're interviewing you for the position, you're interviewing, you're interviewing the manager to see if you'll be a good fit for that unit. So, you completed the interview, you got hired that's your first nursing job so now you're like I don't know what to do what's my first day what do I need what what, what what do I wear so most units and hospitals will have designated scrub colors you have to wear if not wear scrubs biggest thing is make sure you have very comfortable shoes you will be on your feet most of the day <laughs> most because you'll be trying to find where everything is whether the spa is located where radiology, where your lab is, where respiratory is, where charge nurses, where break room is. So comfortable shoes. Make sure you have your stethoscope because your nurse now can't do your assessments without a stethoscope. Scrubs, based on your hospital policy, have your scrub colors, scrubs in the color that your hospital wants you to have. Make sure you have bandage scissors, bandage or trauma scissors, especially if you work in the ER or the ICU. Trauma sh shoes are very, 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 very important. And you're going to be probably given a bunch of paperwork to help you, like when you start orientation, like quick pocket references for drips and phone numbers of different departments will be very handy also. And that should hopefully get you started on your start as a new nurse in your department. Hopefully this is beneficial and helpful. If you have any questions, drop them down below. And I will talk to you all in my next video. Y'all have a good day. Bye.